I'm uh, Andrea Lawless. I'm the head of educational technology and social media here at De La Salle Holy Cross College High School. The school's been around since about 1948. Started with the De La Salle brother, the campus that we're on now. Our brother Alpheus came in from Ireland and he started the school back then. The Holy Cross sisters started their school across the road. And in 1986, the two schools amalgamated to be a co-ed school. So the high school is where we are now and the junior school is across the road. We were previously on a 4 megabit ADSL line and buffering videos and things like that took forever. So using YouTube for educational purposes was just a bit crazy. We installed towards the end of 2016 and so we've been going for just a little over a year. We've moved our email servers onto the cloud which helps our servers on campus because we don't have to replace it every two or three years which is a huge cost and then also the financial implications of not having to pay for our line anymore. We've just got a brand new firewall, so that's also made it life a lot, lot easier. We are going to put the, the students onto the Wi-Fi within the next eight to 10 months, hopefully before the end of uh, 2018, beginning of 2019. The kids will have to then first do their digital citizenship courses so they understand what to do, what not to do online. So the kids will definitely be able to access things like Google Classroom, and get notes offline and, and access research content while in class. So digital citizenship is the, the keys or the, and the skills of conducting yourself online with respect and responsibility. They're gonna do an online course, which is a digital driver's license, and it takes you through different case units. Things like how to protect yourself online, like not handing out personal information, how to protect others online, as well as digital wellness. When, when to put the device down and actually have some time outside. So looking after yourself, looking after your family, and, and being able to conduct yourself online professionally, respectfully, and responsibly. During their LO lessons, with the life orientation lessons, they will be able to do their digital driver's license because it is an online course. So they'll be able to sit either on their, the school devices that they could possibly use or the computer lab and all conduct that online course at the same time. So there will be no like hang-ups and no buffering and no waiting for things to happen because of that high-speed internet access. So we have a couple of smart boards in a few of our classrooms. We don't want to really go one-to-one -one straight off. We want to be able to, the kids to be able to grapple with things like social interaction, social intelligence, collaboration, without having to worry about sitting on a, a tablet all the time. So yes, we will use tablets in the future. We're looking into coding and robotics. So we're bringing the grade sevens across into the high school at the beginning of next year. So we're trying some project-based and inquiry-based learning with them from the beginning of 2019. So thank you very much to Vumatel for the school, school's project. It's most certainly helped us and will make our lives much, much easier, certainly in the future. And to Cool Ideas for being our ISP.